and here is where you've got to be very careful pastors and, and, and leaders of God's people one of the areas you must be very careful is in music symbolisms music and I've warned and you need to take this seriously you know there are people who tell us that uh, the reason they're into a certain kind of music is because that's what the the young people are interested in or those group of people are interested in hold on how worldly should we get to win the world how worldly should we be to win the world how far should we go to get their attention we have to be like them to do so that is a confession of your spiritual bankruptcy because if you were full of the spirit think just think the very thought of it if the apostles said you see we have to be like the Pharisees to win them that's not what Paul was saying when he talked about being like a Jew that's not what he meant We reach people all the time. There are things we do to get their attention. But we don't have to now be like them. We don't have to have their music for them to listen to our music. Yes, we don't have to dance like them for them to think like we're dancing for God. The reason I'm telling you this is about symbolisms. Yes, there are dances that people have and they're doing them in churches. But these dances are demonic. Yes. They are inspired by demons and they're being danced in churches by so-called musical leaders and music, whatever they call themselves. What's actually happening is these are offerings and libations that are, that are being offered to Satan through symbolisms. And demons thrive on these offerings, you have to understand. You have to understand. Demons feed on worship. Demons feed on worship. You sustain them with worship. You know, proud people love attention. Demons also are that way. They love attention. It's like a proud man whose ego you feed. That's the way they are. Get back to true and divine worship. Don't copy the word. Don't copy the word. Music is for worshiping and praising God. That's the primary thing it's supposed to do. Don't use it for your ego. Don't use it for your, for your so-called um, career. It's not given to you to make money for yourself. And I hope that in God's churches, don't give a place anymore. Don't give a place anymore to those who come as music stars because they come to destroy God's churches. They don't know what they're doing. It's been happening for a long, long time. And it's time to stop. It's time to stop it. Pastors, train your people to worship the Lord in truth. To praise the Lord in truth. Stop giving offerings to demons. Look at our, our uh, uh, the, 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 the music, music those who they used to call them music ministers. They dress like the world. They act like the world. They dance like the world. Is that what you want them to teach your people? We allowed it for a long time. We allowed it for a long time. Until the Lord instructed me, not only to stop it, but to let God's people know it's got to stop. And it has to stop. There's no place in the word of God for those things.
We must have God's churches return to true praise and true divine worship. What it is supposed to be in the word of God. Let no man deceive you with carnal words. They've done these things for more than 50 years. And the results have been the same. Carnality in the churches. And these people don't listen to the word of God. Once they are done with singing in your church, they jump to the next church. And when I say things like this, the next thing is, if they don't like it, they go and start a church. Because they, they are not used to sitting to listen to the word of God. These are not soul winners. Because it's all about money at the end of the day. Money and fame. That's what they seek. Money and fame. And so they have used the houses of God for these things for so long. It has to stop. And for those who don't want to stop, God will stop you. Just watch. Just watch. Just watch. And God sent me to tell you these things. You cannot use the ministry of God for financial gain or to groom your ego. It has to stop. So that's what demons, demons love those things. They love it. They love it. They don't mind you singing. They don't mind you acting like you're praising God. But they know that the things you are doing are not scriptural. They know you have no fear of God. They know. That must change in God's house. It's time to change it. You know, every now and then what they do they come up with their album i have my album your album what is this album what is there that's your carnality in your pocket it has to stop i told you I, i've got to tell you these things and share them with you and I'm not even majoring on it now. This is just on the side. And I've shared on several occasions. And there's much more to share with you along these lines. So that you can have sufficient information to deal with these things. And don't let Satan push you again and again. So Pastor Chris, if I don't do this, so what am I supposed to do? What do you mean, what, you, what are you supposed to do? The first thing is, follow his instructions. That's the first thing. And stop creating fake visions for yourself. Stop creating. The Bible talks about those who create their own visions. Visions that God didn't show them. The visions of their mind. They have visions of their mind, which they call God's visions. Someone who doesn't listen to the word of God. Someone who has no spiritual discipline. Who doesn't study the Bible. So, the Lord told me. He didn't tell you anything. He didn't tell you anything. Look at your life. So, you're going to pray. You're going to pray. Pray. During COVID, where were all the musicians? No, they disappeared. No, where were they? All over the world. They were, they, they were either, they, they fled. 
Their ministry ended. Yes, sir. Except that God sent me to rescue you. Hallelujah. But not so you can go back to where you were before. No, where were they singing? It was over. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, their the ministry was over. The churches were shut down. Their, 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 their uh, concerts were gone. Yes, sir. They didn't know what to say. Where was the word of God in your mouth? So the same God that sent me then is the one that is sending me now to still bring you this information. That what you're doing is not going to help. It won't help you. There's a direction from the Spirit. And we should go in that direction. 